A DEXA scan is invaluable. It tells me what your bone mineral density is. So if I'm about to do a fusion or scoliosis correction, that tells me, are you at high risk for a fracture? Are the screws potentially going to pull out? Can the screws cause a fracture? Can the cage or spacer that I put in the disc space subside through the bone? There's a lot of different things that need to be figured out before you undergo a fusion surgery to mitigate as many complications as possible. So usually a T-score lower than negative 2.5 is considered osteoporosis. At that point, I would send you to an endocrinologist or your primary care physician to get you on a bone growth stimulator. There are newer medications out there other than alendronate or the bisphosphonates that will actually help bone remineralize. But again, those can be expensive and you have to have a diagnosis of osteoporosis for you to, to get those medications. It can take anywhere from six months, but usually one year. It may not get to a normal bone mineral density, but at least it does help with microscopic milieu of your bone, at least lower the risk of some kind of bony complication after surgery.